back to Indian Beauty Network. This is your beauty fan tech doctor Farhat Sultana. I am back with another video and this time this video is exclusively about aloe vera gels. Actually I have been using aloe vera gels since my teen hood and I am an avid addict of it and I'm sure you people also use aloe vera gel on a daily basis. They are hundreds and hundreds of benefits of aloe vera gels not just on skin care even on hair care body medicinal properties etc so uh, it's basically an exclusive video on aloe vera gels from a brand known as rustic arts in my teenhood i used to use aloe vera gel from the plant and uh, as the days progress and i got busy with my studies so there was difficulty in extracting the gel from the plant and using it on a daily basis so that's when I got introduced to the aloe vera gels in the market and the first aloe vera gel uh, which I used to use was from a brand known as green leaf that was quite nice affordable during those times many brands does have aloe vera gels they do sell aloe vera gels and my video is about brand known as rustic art the main reason which I have chosen this brand is that they not only just sell aloe vera gels, I mean the plain ones which basically we get in the market, but they do even sell aloe vera gels with different mixtures. So this video is all about a detailed guide of different aloe vera gels from the brand known as Rustic Art. They just not sell the plain aloe vera gels in the market. They do come up with different type of aloe vera gels. The thing is that they do include even other components or composition along with aloe vera gels like cinnamon, lavender, orange etc. Uh, they are also I mean beneficial in a different way not just providing only hydration which aloe vera gel does that so on that note let's get started let me tell you first about their brown rustic art first and the foremost thing which struck me is that they are quality free and vegan and their products are handmade they claims to be a nature's lovers and they do believe in bringing rusticness to every aspect of life that's really interesting and uh, actually their products are free from chemicals toxins and artificial elements chemicals like sulfates phthalates parabens SLEs mineral oil etc and they do include certified ingredients in their products so that was all about rustic art so coming to the gels first thing which I want to talk about is their normal aloe vera gel this looks like this all the aloe vera gels does come in the packaging and with the logo and all the details of the product this is the organic aloe vera gel and it is with lemon extracts it is priced at around 200 rupees for 100 gram product this is plain with no color or anything let me open for you protected by the cap this is their normal aloe vera gel with lemon extract I don't know it smells like hospital smell but it does fade it away when you apply it onto your skin this aloe vera gel claims to be a natural moisturizer and a natural astringent it does heals acne, heals infections, heals inflammations, heals minor cut and burn etc antiseptic aftershave for nappy rashes I tried for the nappy rashes it did work for the uh, not a hardcore nappy rash I did try it for a subtle nappy rash and it did work and it does give good hydration I love using it on a daily basis it is quite effective for hydration as I have got a very dry skin so this was the normal organic aloe vera gel with lemon extract ingredient list is like something like this they haven't mentioned the entire ingredient list 
but they did mention the key ingredients like aloe vera, lemon extract, natural preservative of TCLS. I don't know why they didn't mention the entire ingredient list so that was it let me show you now other types of aloe vera gels which come with the uh, other components or compositions so the first and the foremost which I want to talk about is this aloe vera gel this is their uh, organic aloe vera neem basil gel which is a hundred gram product price at around 320 rupees I love this product uh, recently I have got breakouts and I was getting acne and uh, my face was behaving very bad so I it was then that I started with this aloe vera gel so this was very helpful in clearing my acne during that time if you really want to know about my skincare regime whenever I have acne breakouts do let me know in the comment section down below. I will come up with a video of it with all the products which I use during those times. Uh, so this is it. Let me show you how does it look. It comes with the same logo and all the ingredients. So ingredient list is the same. They did mention a brief ingredient list like organic aloe vera, neem and basil extract, natural preservative of TCLS. You can find the quality free tag and these are the product claims. They claim to be suitable for all skin types, so this nappy rashes, moisturizes rough knees, clear acne, keeps skin nourished, lightens blemishes and scars, soothes in insects bites, heals inflammation, reveals itching, tightens skin pores, skin maintenance for all. So I have a uh, dry skin and my husband does have uh, oily skin and we both are using this product since the day it had arrived and we are loving it. Uh, it is help he is a uh, acne prone uh, person who does get acne on a daily basis and he is loving this product because it is helping him to clear out acne and it is also helping him to prevent acne breakouts. So and for me it is acting a, a very good moisturizer. I don't need extra moisturizer whenever I just want a uh, hydration and whenever I feel that my skin is dry and itchy I just go for this. So this looks like this. Comes with the protective cap again. And this looks like light green in color and does have the smell of neem a kind of a herbal smell which is not bothering at all so this was it rustic art aloe vera neem basil gel so the next aloe vera gel which i love using is this aloe vera gel this is their rustic art organic aloe vera lavender gel it is priced at around 320 rupees for 100 gram product and the ingredient list, list is organic aloe vera, lavender extract, vitamin E, natural preservative of TCLS. And the product claims, the product claims are such like uh, best suitable for dry skin, tightens pores, fades wrinkles, repairs skin, keeps skin moisturized, restores skin nutrients, cooling and soothing, heals minor cuts and burns, fades blemishes, relieves itching. So this is the aloe vera gel exclusively for dry skin. So this aloe vera gel along with lavender extract is good for dry skin. People with dry skin uh, can go for this because this provides excellent hydration. You might be wondering why I have got all these aloe vera gels. These aloe vera gels are for a specific, uh, I mean, specific circumstances like whenever I have acne prone skin I use this aloe vera gel known as aloe vera neem basil gel it is very effective in clearing those pimples and whenever I feel like my skin is very dry and I need hydration I go for this aloe vera lavender gel which is really great and provide excellent hydration and it also uh, uh, it also tightens my pores to a certain extent I've been using this aloe vera gel since a week and I can see uh, uh, good results about it. So 
this is like this it is very light purplish in shade and it has beautiful fragrance of lavender lavender lovers I'm sure you will love this aloe vera gel a lot so this is exclusively for dry skin and the next product is this rustic art organic aloe vera orange cinnamon gel I'm sure you might be very familiar of the benefits of uh, orange and cinnamon cinnamon is very effective in clearing pimples uh, helps fighting with the acne and orange does act like a, a, uh, astringent and it is loaded with vitamin C which is very very uh, essential for the skin to collagen which is necessary for a youthful skin it is priced at around 290 rupees for 100 gram product and it does have ingredient list something like this with aloe vera lemon oil vitamin E orange and cinnamon extract nat natural preservative of TCLS and the product claims are something like this it heals acne anti-aging tones complexion makes skin smooth keeps skin healthy reduces ble blemishes fade scars antifungal antibacterial this is a good product and it is basically for a non-sensitive skin my sister loved this product and it uh, gives a tingling sensation after application initially because of the cinnamon present in it I'm sure and she loved it it does uh, clear her uh, texture and it is very effective it tightens her pore she is loving this aloe vera gel so this looks something like this it is light orange in color having a good smell of orange if you love oranges you will love this so it is a good aloe vera gel for non-sensitive person and the next product is this rustic art organic aloe vera papaya gel it is priced at around 300 rupees for 100 gram product and the ingredient list is something like this organic aloe vera papaya extract vitamin E natural preservative of TCLS and product claims are something like this for all skin type regenerate skin soothes inflammation clears complexion reduces blemishes keeps skin hydrated makes skin smooth remove dead skin heal crack heals cracked heals so I'm sure you might be aware of uh, uh, benefits of a papaya it is very effective exfoliant and is very useful in removing the dead cells so this looks something like this it does have light peach color and have a slight hint smell of papaya in it I love its fragrance I'm yet to try this product and will be coming up uh, with the review on my blog you can check out my blog link in the description down below and the next one is rustic art aloe vera peach avocado gel and it is priced at around uh, 300 rupees for 100 gram products and the ingredient list is something like this organic aloe vera peach and avocado extract vitamin A natural preservative of TCLS and the product claims are best suitable for dry skin, tighten pores, fade wrinkles, repair skin keep skin moisturized, restore skin nutrients as it does contain peach and avocado peach is very effective for hydration and avocado is like a blessing to skin it is said to be suitable for dry skin so I'm sure it will suit my skin but uh, I will be trying this I haven't tried this because I am already on my neem basil and lavender gel so I'll be trying this and I'll be reviewing it on my blog do show check out so it can also be used by our moms who is having dry skin and who wants to have anti-aging uh, uh, aloe vera gel so this can be an anti-aging aloe vera gel so I'm sure you want to check out how does it look it does have a light green a very light green color 
and have the smell of avocado in it so that was all, all the aloe vera gels which can use for our skin the two aloe vera gel which I want to talk about exclusively which I have found that they are unique on their website I haven't seen uh, it anywhere else so the first one is this it is their rustic art after shave and post waxing gel it is priced at around uh, it is priced at around 320 rupees for 100 gram product and does have uh, ingredient list something like this organic aloe vera tea tree extract vitamin A natural preservative of TCLS and the product claims are something like this apply a Apply after shaving or waxing to soothe and nourish the skin. It reduces acne, skin irritation, heals sunburn, keeps skin moisturized, heal minor cuts, insect bites, athlete foods. So this is like a blessing in disguise for me, seriously, because I because uh, I used to have very hard waxing sessions. Whenever I used to go for a waxing session, post waxing, I used to feel my skin used to get very much irritated and it used to burn like hell. And I just used to uh, use a regular moisturizer on it because I have no way other to go. I even tried to use a normal aloe vera gel but it did provide hydration but doesn't soothe my skin well. So after using this, it, it not only provided hydration to my skin, it also provided cooling sensation and all those burning sensation of vaccine faded away quickly. I was really amazed with that and it is my Haji product now. I will be repurchasing this again and again. I'm saying you, this is a really unique product to their uh, website and I'm really enjoying it because it's like a blessing to me for all the vaccine sessions. So you must try that out. It is something like light blue in color. So I am telling you guys, you must try this product. You will like it. It does provide an excellent cooling sensation. And that sensation will last for hours and hours. I'm really happy with this product. And the next product which I want to talk about is the Rustic Art Hair Therapy Gel. And it is priced at around 320 rupees for 100 gram product and the ingredients are something like this organic aloe vera tea tree extract vitamin A natural preservative of TCLS this is a unique product to the brand because uh, we do have a lot of aloe vera gels from different brands in the market but uh, especially this one it, it does mention that it is for hairs I mean you can use it on your hair and the product claims are something like this soothes itchy scalp prevents dandruff help in cradle cap baldness psoriasis head lice add, adds shine and bounce repays clogged hair follicle promotes pigmentation of hair so I don't know how much does it act on um, cradle cap, baldness, psoriasis, head lice and pigmentation of hair but I do, uh, I mean, I do say it is very effective for hair fall and dandruff. Since I have relocated to Bangalore, I don't know why I'm feeling like my hairs are just falling off. And I'm starting to see my hairline and have been freaking out since then so along with uh, along with this I have been using the serum from Oshia Herbals which I will be reviewing it soon on my blog so these are very effective in those situations I mean it is very effective for that I can feel that my hairline is receding and I can feel that my hair has been falling really less so I love this product. It is very unique. I let me show you how it how it looks. It looks something like this, light brown in color and and does have smell of a regular hair product. I can't place it perfectly, but it does smell 
it's nice it's not that bad it's a good product I have been loving all the products from them especially their neem basil lavender and poshif and hair gel and the other products I'm sure I'll be updating it and when I write a review of it on my blog I will be updating it in the description anytime whenever I'll do that so guys this were all the aloe vera gel from the brand known as rustic art my main aim was to show you about the different type of aloe vera gel from this brand because I have seen online that basically there will be a lot of normal aloe vera gels from different different brands and especially this brand known as rustic art it does come up with different aloe vera gels with different composition I mean to say they come up with uh, aloe vera gel with lemon extract aloe vera gel with neem basil extract aloe vera gels with uh, lavender extract aloe vera gel with orange cinnamon aloe vera gel with peach avocado peach avocado aloe vera gel with papaya I loved that I mean I love the concept that each one does act on a specific thing like uh, lavender is for dry skin uh, peach and avocado is dry skin orange and cinnamon is for non-sensitive skin papaya I'm sure papaya one will sort oily skin and the uh, normal uh, aloe vera and lemon extract will suit uh, I mean normal combination skin and combination sensitive and acne prone skin can go for the neem basil, papa uh, neem basil gel and uh, especially these two product are my favorite especially these two product are my favorite which is their post shaving wax and uh, hair therapy gel I love those two product also they are very unique to the brand and I love using them so that was it I'm sure you like this video I'm sure you are happy to know about the different aloe vera gel you can try you can now just not hydrate your skin you can even work on specific problems of the skin you you'll be you'll be facing or you are facing so if you like this video please do like share and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to check out the website of rustic art it is not a sponsored video sure but they have sent me the product to try and I really love them and that is why I am suggesting you please do check out their website and if you like this video please do like share and subscribe to my channel if you are already a subscriber thank you so much Thank you so much for watching. I'll be back with another video very soon. Take care. Bye.